Hey everyone, Jason here. Last week I built this clockwork heart and I wasn't really planning to make one of these videos for it, but after posting it online on Valentine's Day, I received a lot of requests for more information and for building instructions. So let's take a closer look at how it actually works. The first thing you will notice is that there are a lot of gears on this and the sole purpose of most of them is just to drive other gears and make it look more complicated than it actually is. So the first thing we're going to do is take off some of these big gears on the front layer so we can really take a closer look at the heart of the mechanism. And right now I have it manually operated using this crank in the back which is connected to this 24 tooth gear in the front which drives this piston and all the piston is is a four stud long Technic axle with a stopper on the end which catches the teeth of this 24 tooth gear with every stroke and pushes it two notches. And that is all there is to it. This gear is just connected to all these other gears in order to rotate them. It would actually be really interesting to expand this by splitting this gear train in two and having the piston catch a gear on one of them in the forward stroke and then catch a gear on the other one in the backstroke in order to get a dual cycle pump like in a real human heart. But I will leave that to you to play with or I may revisit this model in the future sometime. There are a couple different ways it can be motorized but probably the easiest is to pop out the axle connecting that large gear and replace it with a longer one so that it sticks out the back. And if we put a Technic pin in the hole beside it, now we can just attach an M motor directly to the back like so. And we'll put the large gear back on. And now we can just power the M motor and there we go. So I have put together building instructions for it. You can find those along with some notes about the construction over at jkbrickworks.com as usual. And as always, I hope you enjoyed the model and the video. Thanks for watching, keep on building, and I will see you next week. Yeah, we'll go with next week.